So you guys said you want to retire in 13 or 14 years. That um, was your goal? From the starting point, yeah. So before Correct. before 40 is kind of what I'm picking up. You know, I think it's changed a little bit because we've kind of reevaluated how how much we want to work right now. So, like, we've been grinding, grinding. And then uh, Brian comes in, like, last week. He's like, I don't think I want to work this hard for that much longer. And I'm like, okay, that's fine. Let's run the numbers. And we did, like, a three- and a five-year scenario where you keep working hard for three to five more years, and then you cut your clients in half or something like that, and you, like, work significantly less so you can be a very, like, present father, and we can go on more trips together. And we won't have to save as much because we already saved so much and put it into invest investments. So I think that numbers change, and it's more like we don't want to necessarily stop working in eight years. We just want to take our foot off the gas you want to work less. and work yeah. less in five years. Somewhere between 35 and 40 was the original goal. Yeah, the, 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 the original, we'll call it 40. Yeah. We'll call it 40, original goal post. Now, on your way there, okay, mm -hmm. you met Brian because mm -hmm. you were doing this before you met Brian. Is that correct? Yeah, I was saving my money. Yeah. Okay, so you and Brian get in alignment. We've talked about some of the things with being a couple, right? Yeah. Talk to us about some of the tactics you guys take okay. for managing your money. So we both max out 401ks. We both max out the Roth IRAs. Um, we can't do a back, well, we could do a backdoor Roth, but we have such a high traditional balance, like in a rollover IRA, that we'd have to convert that first, so it doesn't make sense. That's why I actually opted to do a 401k Roth or Roth 401k instead to get my Roth balance more Good equal. To go. to my so uh, there's another great strategy and tactic there, right? Yeah, automating your savings, I think, is super important. Yeah, so let's okay. talk about that, the set and forget strategy. Yeah. Um, I think if you come up with how much you're going to spend on an annual basis, and then you can come up with how much you want to save per month based on that spending, you don't even have to think about saving. It'll go straight to your brokerage account or straight into your 401k, and you don't even have to think about it, and that like takes away the option to spend overspend what you wanted to because there's no money in your checking account with mm -hmm. you know you have maybe like a little bit of a buffer in there but you can't spend it uh do you guys do anything brokerages yes so i mean we can only save so much into the retirement accounts right and then everything else goes straight to a brokerage account and we okay. all put it into the total index stock market so vti vanguard yes. total index mm -hmm. one it's actually f0 fzrox because it's fidelities and it has a zero percent uh Fee. Hey. Yeah. Hey, there you go. Fire fee is important, Christine. I mean, they take a little piece of your money every single year. Mm -hmm. I think it's a year. Yeah. So, and that's why I always roll out of uh, companies 401k too, because there's a fee in there and it's very hidden, so you can't really see it. And then you don't have as many options. Oh, no. So, so when you leave a company and you have a 401k balance, I always choose to roll it out into a rollover IRA because there are hidden fees within those 401k plans. Yes. And it's very hard to find, even if you are in a low Cost. index. I know. It's insane. It's crazy. So what's your favorite funds that you, you like? I only use, I think, F -Zero, F -Z -R -O -X because it's the total stock index. Fund. And then an S&P 500, whatever that one is at Fidelity or Vanguard. Solid advice there. It's low anxiety, low maintenance, and can you set up auto invest? Yes, you can. Perfect. So you don't have to do anything. Nope. You just have to go get your paycheck from work and you're good to go. <laughs>